Here comes an 0-2 pitch. Got him looking. How could there be a tape of a guy? Off the hands, right center field, falling in a hurry, base hit. It gets behind Patterson. Either way, Sheffield was going to score, and it's one to nothing, New York. RBI number 59 for Alex Rodriguez. We'll show you the numbers that he's put together all while playing with a twisted right ankle. We won't get the chance as Derek Lee makes a good play to his right to end the inning. And a ground ball to A-Rod. Nice play off his left hip, and the inning is over. Wong is working quickly, and he gets a nice play from Rodriguez to end the top of the second. Good changeup from Wong. Another and one. another one. Back-to-back -back changeups. 185. That 184, and a strikeout is the second. Swing was any better than Dick Allen. 4 6 3, and off we go into the bottom of the fourth. They hit by Lee. Burnett bounces into the double play. Wong is rolling. He and the Yankees have a 1 to nothing lead. The switch hitting catcher digs in and rips it into right center field. That's going to add to the Yankee lead. Posada and Matsui trade places. 2 nothing New York in the fourth. And Posada. Drives in the guy who's been in the middle of all the action for the Yankees, Matsui. Grants today are made in honor. What a play by Lee. Down the line to take an extra base hit and run away from the Yankees. You saw the faces of the two winners. Diamondbacks outfielder Sean Green, American League winner Corey Hunter. And here's a gold glove play from the gold glover down the line to his left. He can do it all. Derek Lee, 2-0 New York. His first time up when he flied to center. We hope to give you a chance to hear that. Steady grounds to first. Three, six, three. Nicely turned by Tino Martinez and Derek Jeter. And he's gone. Wong has been fantastic. Three strikeouts. He's allowed three singles. Maintain his job. Now the dangerous Sheffield who lines one into center field. Patterson will come up throwing. To the plate is Cano. Throw cut off, and it's 3-0 Yankees in the fifth. Cano, who started this inning with a hit score. Here is Jason Dubois, the DH in the number nine spot, and he rips one into left center field. Is that going to go up and out? The Cubs are on the board. It's 3-1. Another strikeout for Wong. That's four on the day. 2-1 pitch. In the air to left center field. Back is Hollinsworth at the wall. It is his first grand slam. On one and one, up the middle to his right. Cano, what a play. Two out. We're going to have to wait on the Yankee Stadium talk as we watch Cano act like Jeter. Making the catch is one thing. The strong throw is quite another. More pitches this inning than any other, thanks in large part to Barrett, who strikes out. Posada finishes it, and Wong has been in total control from the get-go. He struck out five, walked one, and allowed one run on five hits. And Jeter hits it into right center field. Pretty well hit at the wall. That is off the top of the wall. They're calling it. And Jeter thinks it's a home run. No umpire made any signal. And now Jeter's being told the ball's in play. That ball looked like it was gone, but the second base umpire... Mike Riley didn't make any sign, and now he does, and says it's a home run. Yeah, it looked like it hit the... 2-2. <laughs> Two -two. In the air to left, Womack is under it. The Yankees have won the first two games of this series.
against the Cubs, and the Cubs are now 0-5 in their franchise history here at Yankee Stadium. Tanyan Sturts shuts it down, a two-hour, 42-minute game, an 8-1 victory.